a reader recalls the first time he played the original GTA, his history with the franchise, and his hopes for its future. I have been a huge supporter of the Grand Theft Auto games, even from the very first one on the first PlayStation console. The first time I saw gameplay of the first Grand Theft Auto was back in 1997 on the PC. When I saw this being played I couldn't believe how amazing the game looked and what it offered. Because of this game, it was one of the reasons I bought a PlayStation console just to play it. The demo for this game came with the official PlayStation magazine at the time, and I could not stop playing the demo even though it had a timer that would cut the game off and lose your progress after 5 minutes. The first Grand Theft Auto was the only game one really enjoyed playing and with three cities to explore it was a hell of a game for back in October 1997. Also, with radio stations containing music on the disc you could put the disc in an audio CD player and listen to the music of the game disc. Next came GTA London 1969 and after this Grand Theft Auto 2, which raised a new bar to set the standard for action-adventure games. Of course, this was raised even higher upon the release of the next-generation successor on the PlayStation 2 Grand Theft Auto 3. This for the first time introduced a brand new 3D world which had amazing, never-seen-before features and more radio stations with tons of audio tracks and even talk reality shows that brought laughter and entertainment to every Grand Theft Auto player. There was also building interiors which players could explore in future Grand Theft Auto games. Even in Grand Theft Auto Vice City the interiors greatly improved, showing the revolution in action-adventure games by Rockstar. Many more Grand Theft Auto games were developed and released, and showed beyond reasonable doubt how action-adventure games should be done. Grand Theft Auto has become such a highly successful and popular game series that it has even grown to a huge online presence via GTA Online as well as other previous games in this series, like GTA 4 and episodes from Liberty City, Grand Theft Auto has allowed a higher level of freedom than other games of previous eras, which has shown fans that this series will only get better with age. As the future comes I will most certainly be looking forward to more future titles in this franchise and the advancements it will offer, as we see newer generation hardware and systems in the future. I currently have every Grand Theft Auto game for the PlayStation and Xbox systems, and with the other titles out there on multiple systems there is a Grand Theft Auto game for even those new to the series. It may not be long before we see Grand Theft Auto expand to even the Nintendo Switch in the future, if Nintendo is happy to welcome the franchise to its platforms. I will forever remember the memories this series has offered, with its excellent storylines and universes, as well as its great features and funny moments. By reader Gasby Rotten Gamer Tab The readers featured does not necessarily represent the views of Game Central or Metro. You can submit your own 500 to 600 word reader feature at any time, which if used will be published in the next appropriate weekend slot. As always, via email gamecentral at uckmetro.co.uk and follow us on Twitter.